Certainly wouldn't be unique to see Brazilians on the podium here. And of course, they always enjoy the success. Two great sporting nations clashing in the bronze medal match here. Brazil versus China. Time for set three. Time for Marcio to send the ball over. On pop by Wu. Nicely done by Ricardo. Got the block but was denied. Shoes there again. Top defensive work by China. Ricardo's there again. He is back on the block. Big high rise, follow the trajectory of the ball. That's a Hikata, we all know. Matsu, once more, Wu is the target. Up against Hikata again. This time, Kart followed up with a second. Nicely executed by China. One all then. 15 points the target here in the tiebreaker. Well done, Shu. Rising high. Can't get there the second time. Here comes Wu, who places it quite beautifully above the reaching hands of Ricardo Santos. Was he looking to hit that? Had to get up really high and uh, put a trajectory on the ball that was almost vertical to make the line there. Another gift for China. This time he'll try from further out. This time gets the touch off Shu. And at the side change, Brazil had the side out. Ricardo. Angry with himself. He's done it so many times that he really should be angry with himself. He's much, much better than that. Never been the world's greatest server. Rarely gets it wrong so often. Thinks about going over in two. The reception was poor by Marcio. And Ricardo's uh, making sure his partner knows that. Five two for China then. All that work to force a third set. Brazil on the verge of pressing self-destruct here. Shulin Yin. Ricardo gets there. Has to pedal around to get there. Matsu makes it. And there's a bit of reconciliation after that uh, brief uh, argument they had. Now Marcio really can't waste another serve here. He's also been guilty of his fair share. Puts it into Wu. Easy enough to deal with. And they set up, put the attack with uh, constable ease. It's a watch, it's a painful watch, and even more painful if it hits a line and it's an ace. Moving, swerving, and viciously dipping. Oh, super serving by Wu. And Brazil called timeout. Chinese will be delighted with their comeback at the start of the third set.
of the serves of the match up there with uh, Ricardo's forceful effort. We saw at the end of the second set. Float serve can be such a strong, dangerous weapon if it's used correctly. Yeah, that out of your picture whilst we see some of these ultra motion replays. The Chinese first back onto the court, want to continue everything going. Want to keep the momentum up. Timeouts, of course, invariably do put a halt to some momentum. Here's Wu trying to change that. Now Ricardo sends one right back at them. That was the hit of an angry man. Keep your head cool. That will surely be the message between the Chinese players. It's a fact made uh, all more complicated with the presence of the crowd and the presence of Ricardo, who certainly decides to turn on the style. Great block. Once more reaching over to the right and following the trajectory of the ball. Ricardo will go again, get some help from the net. And from four points down, they call a timeout, and suddenly they're back to within a point. Oh, a giant swing of momentum. That momentum, though, quite cleverly. It's hoping to be holded by the Chinese who themselves do their own timeout card. Time for another sit down. Time to have a quick chat. Both teams know exactly what they've got to do here. Both will now know that they're in the real fight for bronze. So then, will the Chinese time out halt this man's advance? Here he goes again. Decent serve. Shuli Nin is there and responds accordingly. China also showing that they're aware tactically. But you have played well today. They've done all week. The only blip really that loss to the semi finals against him unwell. Now, listen, yesterday, Ricardo. Trying to get to the set, Matsu, with his initial reception, really putting the big man under pressure. Not, a, not really getting up to it. Truly, Nguyen was onto it much quicker. Ben Nguyen was uh, a delighted spectator in the backcourt there. with the serve goes very deep indeed but it's taken down by Marcio looks to finish Wu's there reads it exceptionally well and finds a finish that he was looking for so there he goes 10-6 four points the difference here comes Shu towards Marcio, needs a response, left-handed, shoes there, and that is a huge block in the context of the match. Five points now the difference. Brazil and their challenge is collapsing. Looks as though Marcio having a problem or two with that troublesome knee of his too. Need to get up in instalments there. Cut shot. Marcio and Ricardo entering the last chat saloon, really, in terms of getting themselves back into the third set. China score already four up. 
really need to put a string of points together now. Here comes Marciu. Moves there. Nicely taken down. Needs to be passed from a long way. And Marciu makes it. Valley still on as Wu looks to attack. This time he's too good. And China once more reassert what has been, if you look at the match overall, fairly decent dominance. Serve once more's target to the left hand of Marcio. Brilliant stuff by Shu, makes it. Hikaru needs to get down and uh, it's a long way down for the big man. A long, long way down. They're really slipping away from them now. Big, strong fight they've put together. Crowd's been behind them all the way. China proving just too strong, it seems. Two points away from victory here. Carter thinks about it on the second again. Match is squeezing it through. Brings Ricardo on a serve. Jump serves down the line towards Wu. He's now up, it's close to the net, but it's uh, well met by the defender. And it's now a max point, and it's bronze medal point. Here comes Shu then. Uh, going for glory with the final hit. I can afford to have done so as well. Difference is still five. Marcio now. Wu takes down. It's a decent serve by Marcio. Wu looking for the finish. Marcio's there. Chance still on. Here he goes. It's a hit on the angle. And the crowd explodes with delight. Still a long way back. Sure, they'll try though. Four max points still yet to be saved. Once more, it's towards Wu. In off the block, Harvey.